The row about whether or not there should be a third runway at Heathrow has been going on for years. The government's backed the plans, but campaigners who want to stop it happening have taken their fight to the High Court. So why the controversy? Well, the anti-runway lobby claims the expansion is at odds with Britain's climate change targets and is bad for the UK's carbon footprint. They say it would wipe out the nearby village of Sipson, taking with it 700 homes, ruining local businesses, increasing noise pollution and casting a shadow over parks and gardens. But those who want to see expansion insist there simply isn't enough space at Heathrow for the predicted air traffic, that a third runway would enable the airport to compete with the likes of Charles de Gaulle and Schiphol. At the moment, around 480,000 planes take off and land at Heathrow every year. A third runway would boost that figure to 605,000 by 2020, generating billions of pounds every year, creating 65,000 new jobs. Now they've got the green light for expansion, they want to press ahead. But those against the runway won't take it lying down.